To solve a system of linear equations in MATLAB, we first need to rewrite the system as a matrix equation. Let's see how it's done, using a small system as an example. We start by organizing the system. We want all constant terms on the right side of the equations. We then move the unknown variables and their coefficients to the left, while making sure that the variables appear in the same order in every equation. If one or more variables aren't present in a particular equation, we'll still include them, but with a coefficient of zero. We'll also place ones in front of any single variable. Now that our equations are organized, we form a column vector from the constants on the right side of the equations and a matrix from the coefficients on the left. The last step is to insert the vector of unknown variables. We usually denote the coefficient matrix A, the constant vector B, and the vector of unknown variables X. And there you have it, a matrix equation equivalent to the original system of linear equations.